And one thing I can guarantee, he does not train as hard as me. He does not dedicate himself as much as me. How do I know that? Because it's not possible. It's not possible to be training harder or more consistently or more dedicated than me because I couldn't give a single ounce more to any aspect of this thing that I'm doing. So that makes me feel pretty powerful and pretty confident. Everything's mental. The, you know, the whole thing is about getting in the gym and, and training hard and lifting weights. That's how I did it. That's how Lee Haney did it. That's how Ronnie did it. And guys now, they're more interested in taking a rest and taking their picture and, on their iPhone and putting it onto Instagram. What's going to separate the guy from first place, from second, from tenth place? Then it's going to be what you put into it. You know, you get out what you put in, and I think I put in more than everybody else. I was mentally stronger, I always trained harder. I knew that, and my competition knew that. So that's why they couldn't beat me. Because the kind of training I was doing and the physique level I was getting to was something nobody had done before. How far can I take this? How big can I get? How ripped? How, you know, all this stuff.
What your you build your story with your with your mind, you know. And I built this story. I wanted to be Mr. Olympia. That starts with a thought, then come the actions. So everything starts with your mind, your your thoughts, and you can you can change your existence, change your reality.